Have you ever wondered what it would be like to live in a completely abandoned town for a full 24 hours? No police, no restaurants, no people. Oh, how's it? Can you guess where I am? I'm in the literal middle of nowhere. I'm in the middle of South Africa and I drove eight hours to get here. Just because I thought it was a sick idea. Just a whole bunch of abandoned buildings. That's gonna be sick, Matt. It's 10 past 10 in the afternoon. Tomorrow, I have to make it to 10 past 10 to complete this entire thing. Just by the way, the nearest hospital is an hour away. There could be snakes here and there's a windmill. Apparently, holy shit, my hair looks weird like that. This is the middle of town. The floorboards are rickety as shit. There's a nice gaping hole in the wall there, which is adds to the aesthetic of the place. Hello. This is a cool area though. God, I'm gonna fall through the floorboards. Whoa. There's a whole little area out here. That's pretty cool. Check out all of this. All of this is abandoned. That's crazy. Check that old car. Mad thing. Which is a mad thing. I think someone's living here though. Keep calm and Batman. I swear it's Batman. I wonder what this is. Probably like where they sacrifice people. That's a fireplace. Actually, I don't know what this is. It looks burnt though. Fucking hard and I. They're definitely aliens out here. How is the fucking computer part so far out here? Damn. This is so. This place has been abandoned for flipping ages. Oh, that's cool. Check that. There's not even a floor anymore. It's just sand. This is a cool door. Nice and fucking broken. What? This is like fully grown in here. Like full on. Oh my god. Check at this. Full fucking tree in here. Sick. Time to go get murdered by a demon in this house. Yo, get fucked. Shit. This looks so dodgy. There's even fucking caution tape. What the fuck was that? <laughs> well, let's go. We don't have a tent. I forgot to bring one. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna- Yep, duct tape. That's what I'm gonna make a flippin' tent out of. I need to make that tent before tonight because it gets minus four here. Four. So if I don't finish it, I'm gonna suffer. I'm gonna do the poles first. I'm gonna fucking hit it in yeah. Mm. I am man, I am cave, I am man cave. <laughs> what I'm planning on doing is taking this rope, tying it to that pole over there, and then bringing it across and tying it to this pole over here. Obviously not like this. Once I've tied it, I'm gonna put tape this side, tape that side, tarpaulin on my schmlaulin. As you can see, I'm a very bush wise person. I'm sick at it. I don't wanna get fucking bitten by a snake. Oh, that's comfy. Wait, actually, it's not that bad. Oh, never mind. It is. The line is on. Now, I do duct tape. I really hope to God this works because if it doesn't, I'm gonna have to figure out another plan. That looks super awesome. <laughs> do you think I'll fit in here? I'm so dumb. All the sticky parts are in the middle here. This might be the first DIY project that I do that actually works. Looks like shit, but I think it'll work. I mean, it's dark, pretty fucking dark. I would rather not be here. I don't know about you, but that looks like a pretty comfy bed to me. A uh, washing line, you can easily hang your washing inside dripping onto your floor, making everything wet. So that's a dub, I think. I don't know if you've seen that scene from I Am Legend. This room, imagine if I walked in here and they're like, 
I don't actually know what I would do. I'm stuck in the middle of nowhere. And you even have a little broom. I, I actually better not touch that. It's probably got so many diseases. And poo, just poo on the floor. That's the way to do it. Like check how old this poo is. Why am I speaking about nice paint choice? I mean, I don't know what all of this is, but it looks like shit to me. And it looks like a good time, so I'm in. Jeez, like. Look at that massive hole. Well, this is a nice place to live. This is a bit creepy, I'm not gonna lie. Everything's decrepit and falling apart. What are those? What is that for? I definitely think it's to hang your newborn baby on, just to dry it out. Don't know why I said that. Check off flipping close that is to breaking. Wouldn't mind that breaking on my face. What is this? A bit weird, isn't it? We're at 50%. Look at that. That's actually quite cool. Don't even lie to me, it's quite cool. I might just get through tonight. I don't know what happened to my voice. Hot past six now. And tent is almost done. I'm getting cold. Getting dark, dark, it's getting dark. Rat, 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 also bark. I'm getting a little bit nervous. Last night when I was in the car, I heard either barking or shouting and I don't want to talk about this because I'm a very superstitious person. I do not want to... I don't want to hear like skinwalker type of stuff and apparently you'd speak about that kind of thing it manifests. Our word. That's so fucking sick. I'm here doing a vid for you guys in the middle of nowhere for you guys in the middle of nowhere for you guys I'm having a sick time it's quite like a spiritual feeling I don't know it doesn't always need to be something deep it's actually just nice being here let me just give you an update on like what it actually looks like close up so it's kind of spacious okay kind of spacious kind of not it's not terrible this part here is an absolute shambles yeah yeah don't know what i'm gonna do about that pitch black it is pitch black look i'm a tad scared i'm not gonna lie <laughs> When I'm in situations like this, I get fucking paranoid. Why are we scared? What the fuck are we scared for? Fuck that. Fuck that. Let's have a good time. We out here. Having a good time. I'm almost done with my, my tent. It is done. Over there, I put fucking swimming tiles because I couldn't be asked anymore. Kind of shitting my pants. Haven't done this. Well, I did this when I spent 24 hours on roof, but this is like different. Got my fucking stove. I've got a full meal, a full meal and cook. I am so keen for this. And my tent is freaking looks dope. I'm sorry, but look at that. That looks so banging. It's so nice. I am still weary, but I'm very happy at the moment. I'm gonna eat and then I'm gonna hop in the mansion of a tent and doors. I'm literally, <laughs> this thing's so tight. It's like I'm cave fucking crawling. You know those oaks that cave dive and stuff? Or like crawl through caves. Ah, oh, my neck. Okay, well, this is it. It's tiny and my legs are exposed, which is fucking great. See you tomorrow. It's three degrees this morning. I'm freezing, I'm burnt, I stink. I did camping in that thing. It's horrible, it was actually very warm, but it was tiny. Fuck. Oh, my hands are so cold. Uh, Jesus, how do people fucking live out here? Well, onto this building. I won't lie, this building looks a lot better, a lot brighter, seeing as it doesn't have a roof on it. What if you wanted to like throw a house party here? 
You know how loud you could make the music? This is exactly the type of thing I would want in my room. A full on tree growing through my window. Hey babes. What if that's poisonous? That was so stupid of me. Does it have that milk stuff in it? Five hours later. You know, if plants have that milky stuff in it and you eat it, you fucked. Come on, man. It's fucking Mark Nolan. And I'm on a fucking skeets adventure. I don't know if you can see, but there's a little animal in that building. So I might get, I might get attacked by this thing. There's something there. And there's a beehive there as well. So I'm hoping I don't get fucked. Look at it. I hope it doesn't attack me. I'm definitely not going into that room. Okay, I'm actually a bit nervous going in this room. Because this is where that freaking animal is. But honestly, it must be so satisfying. There's a massive reason why I would buy this place. I'd buy this how it is right now. That massive hole in the roof. That's the biggest selling point of a house for me. There's a huge hole, gaping hole in the roof. I honestly don't know how people live out this far. Like, that's too much. Mm. Imagine if someone invites you over to their house. And this is literally exactly what it's like. Smashed windows, holes in the roof. They're gonna murder you, you dead. I don't even know, I probably, I'm probably gonna get fucking murdered here. Well, this is my home. Take great care of it. Um, holes in my roof for, for better ventilation. Feeling paint. Nice touch, whatever that is. I'm under the water, please help me. Probably a fucking chimney. Some nice floor decorations, you know? This over here is where that rat thing is. Look how much literal shit is on the floor. I really want to look at it though. Anyways, this is my view, you know, got the broken windows, great for security. I wonder what it must have been like living here. I have one extra. I think it's time for coffee. We are now an hour away from being here for almost a full day. And to celebrate, I'm gonna eat raw eggs. I'm gonna make flapjacks, banging flapjacks. So while I was mixing these flapjacks, I didn't realize I put the entire mix into the pan, which means if I carried on cooking, I would have made one giant flapjack. So I got so stressed out here. Got my flapjacks, got my coffee, 24 hours done. Bye. Uh, uh.